Today I'm going to paint a simple daisy. Now if you notice when I did the, did the peony, I did it disjointed, I did it in a couple of colors. So that just kind of is a way I like to do things. It just, you, the mind will fill it in. The mind knows that that is what that is and it will fill it in. But I don't know. It's simple and I just like doing it that way. My first step on this is going to be to just paint the whole background green. <laughs> Maybe I need to turn it a little. Okay. This is a Viridian. It's called Viridian. So if I want to put some leafy things on there later, I can use a lighter green. I'm going to start with the center I'm getting my hold on to this thing I could just brush in a little center thing and it would be fine Oh, I didn't want to go out that far. Okay. Need a need one that big, but I guess that's how we'll make them. I am not doing the next plague today. Instead, I'm doing this because, for one thing, I need to 
I need to practice sketching it first. It is the locust. This is the plague of locusts. The gnats and the flies I got by with just being a little just putting dots on there and I'm not really satisfied with the way I did it but I didn't know how to on that small of a thing to have but with locusts I need to have at least one or two look like a locust and not just a blob I will still be on the small canvas okay now yes my lovely toothpick I love my lovely toothpicks that's yeah, much better Come on. I think that's getting a little dry because I let it set for a while. <sighs> One of the problems with the gray, it's so close to the same color as the foil. <laughs> Sometimes I have to go hunting to find it. Well, my shaking did disturb that one, but for the most part, it's not too bad. Get these little pollen things in here and let the bees be happy. The bees and the butterflies. watched one today on the dodo that's the name of the YouTube channel the dodo and it's a lot of it is about an, animal rescues and odd ones mostly odd animal rescues and this girl she rescued a moth and It had its it had its eggs. It laid its eggs. I guess she gave it something to lay them on, and the little caterpillars grew, and then they got into their little chrysalis phase, and came out new moths. So she raised a bunch of moths, and I thought, well, that is something completely different. This moth loved her. It would. <laughs> It would just climb all over and the mother moth. I don't know if she was able to let the babies go. Because <laughs> that would be their normal instinct at birth. Okay. This is what I call finished. And I hope you do too. And there it is. I love you. See you tomorrow. And smile and wave at somebody. <laughs>